Despite calls for improvement, poor research design and data analysis continue to encourage false positive findings. This is because researchers are motivated to continue to produce work that is more popular with the public, which leads to the selection of methods that are more likely to result in false positive findings. We show that the incentives for promoting good research lie primarily at the level of the laboratory where scientists work. In a competitive laboratory environment, successful scientists produce more research papers, which in turn encourage their students to start similar research laboratories. This dynamics leads to continued use of bad methods and increasingly high false discovery rates. In order to improve the quality of science, it is necessary to change incentives at the institutional level. This article is titled The Natural Selection of Bad Science and was authored by Paul E. Smaldino and Richard McElreath. We are article.tv. Article links can be found in the video description.